So we paid 40, 50 dollars for it. You see that profit margin there? Yeah. What's up, us? It's your favorite country cousin, JT. I'm back here on another video. I'm here with Mr. Travis Cooper of Generational Wealth Vibes, subject matter expert here on the channel for all things Amazon. So what we're gonna do in this video is really show you guys how simple it is for anybody to get into this business and make money. I'm gonna challenge Travis today to teach my uncle how to do this business. We're gonna use uh, just these books as like a prop so that way you guys can understand the concept of how to do it. I finally figured it out. What did I figure out? I'm so glad that you asked. The problem that we both have is that while I love social media, as do you, or you at least like it, or you wouldn't be seeing this video, we do not get to control the algorithm. Why does that matter? Why is that a problem? If I create a video that can teach you how to make more money step by step, or create generational wealth or invest or just in any way better your financial journey but multi-billion dollar advertisers don't want to run ads against that sort of content because it doesn't fat in their pockets do you know what social media algorithms are going to do not send out notifications think about it how many people do you follow across social media they drop new videos but you say i never saw a notification i didn't know that video came out and you could be missing out on game it could be one piece of information that could change your life for the rest of your life but just because a multi-billion dollar advertiser doesn't want to advertise against that content it will reduce the notifications that go out now i'm not here to complain I believe that if you identify a problem, you should also offer a solution. Here's my solution. Join my newsletter. It's absolutely free. It's the Providence Professional. I call it the Providence Pro Newsletter. And what I'm going to do for absolutely free is I'm going to email you the opportunities. And then you decide if that opportunity is something that you want to check out and change your life for the rest of your life or you decide if that's something that's not interesting to you i think that while we all need these big companies they serve a purpose in the marketplace i create content to help people that's on their way to financial freedom not multi-billion dollar companies that are trying to become multi-trillion dollar companies i love them i'm unapologetically an entrepreneur but i'm here for you join the free providence pro newsletter link underneath this video and you start making the choices for yourself. Stop letting big advertisers determine what information you are allowed or not allowed to see. Let's get back to today's action. Join the newsletter. Peace. And if you guys want to learn more, stay to the end of the video. I'll give you guys an opportunity to connect directly with Travis to learn how to do this for yourself. So, okay, I got to go grab my aunt and then we going to get started right now. All right, Mr. Jerry, so thank you for joining us on this video. So essentially what I'm going to do in this video is just give you a high level overview on what I do on Amazon. So I have this one product that I bought online, but I'm just telling you about the structure initially. So on Amazon, have you ever purchased or bought anything on Amazon before, no, sir? Never. Never purchased. Okay, so he doesn't use any Amazon, so I'm going to just give him a back. A little bit of backdrop on Amazon backstory. So Amazon now is the biggest online store in the world. So a lot of people are buying on Amazon. Shoot, I seem like the last time I checked, I think it's over thousands of orders per second on Amazon. That's how fast they're buying. So my business model is um, Amazon is also the biggest online bookstore in the world. Okay, so. Any kind of book that you need, you can type it in on Amazon nine times out of 10, you can find it. The way I structure my business is to find, because I know so much attention is on Amazon and I know people are spending a lot of money. I'm thinking, how can I get into that pool of money? So imagine a big pool of money and we want to put our bait and our fishing rod in that bad boy to start pulling some money out of it, okay? So with all the money here, I want to see what they're buying. So we use software to see, okay, we know people are buying on Amazon, but what are they spending their money on? One of the things because they have so many of them on Amazon is books. So I said, well, how can I find these books that they're buying on Amazon? Initially, I started out, um, have you been to any thrill stores like Goodwill? I think JT yeah. said you like Goodwill. Like, <laughs> yeah. Have you ever noticed that uh, it's always a book section somewhere in the corner in Goodwill? Have yeah. you noticed books? Yeah. Yeah. So that's where I started my journey. The books are usually a dollar, two dollars, 50 cents, something like that when you go in there. 
Um, so I would just take out my phone. It's an app called Scout IQ. You can scan those books in there. And Goodwill, some of the times they've been checking, but um, sometimes they don't sell on Amazon. You can scan some of them books and believe it or not, you can go in there, pay a dollar or two, you look it up with a Scott IQ, or you can use the Amazon app, and they're selling for $20, $50, $100 online. A lot of people don't go to that book section. They might go to the clothes or to the electronics or the wear. What's your favorite uh, category to go to in Goodwill? Uh, a section. Maybe clothes. Clothes and stuff. Uh, electronics. Electronics, okay. Um, but yeah, in that, in that book category, you just scan it on your phone. So this particular set here, I purchased. So initially when I started, I used to drive around. So I took that same idea and looked up for cheap places to buy it online. So this particular set, um, Harry Potter were, was purchased on eBay. So I was able to get this for probably around 40 or 50 bucks right here. So. Whenever I purchased it, if you, you guys, I'm gonna show you guys this. This is what we scan. Okay. This is called a barcode. So let me see if I can scan it here on my phone. So this is the app that I use here, Mr. Jerry. It's Scott IQ. So once you download it on your phone, I'm pretty sure you downloaded some different right. apps on your phone right. before. Right. It's called Scott IQ. You would just press this button here and then you hold that over the barcode. So again, I think I paid 40 or 50 dollars for this set. This is um, brand new. We're going to use you a tap under here under FBA. So we paid 40, 50 dollars for it. You see that profit margin there? Yeah. He already smiling. Look at him. He said, he said 120 dollars. So, but we paid 50 for it. So we would essentially, after we get our 50 dollars back, we would make an extra 70 on top of it. Okay, so does that seem pretty simple so far? You have, okay, so what questions would you have about this if you were to start this business? My book would be, where would I start? Where would you start? So, great question. The first thing you would need to do to start this business is set up an Amazon account. So, inside of that, I, you know, not trying to sell you anything, but for the people out there, you can YouTube it or if you get inside of my training, so the first thing you would do is figure out, or not figure out, I will walk you through how to set up your Amazon account. So step by step, while we on the training, you would just, your screen would look like my screen. So the first thing is get an Amazon account, and once it's active, you in business. You would be able to go out the same way that I'm showing you here. You might even do it next time you in Goodwill, just to see if you can find something. That'd be a good um, thing to do if you ever feel like it. Scan and see. Uh, if you can find any books that's profitable and there can be some extra little side money. So you can find any book you want in Amazon? Okay, almost any book. So I would say any book in Goodwill, 99% of the time it's going to already be on Amazon. That's how big of a store it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tell us what you're supposed to do. Download Amazon, I'll scan the barcode, and go from there. What go from there mean? Go for the barcode. <laughs> I just don't see now. Compare your price, what you pay, and what you and boom. What the price you pay and what you pay, what you what you will make your profit. Right, I know what you mean. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, that's okay. what you, you got. Mean. So after so after that, essentially, yeah. what he would do if he liked his numbers, you would take it to your Amazon account, and I would show you how to list it on your account. Okay, so yeah. that would be the next step from there, and then once it sells, once you sign up, connect it to your your bank account, so you get a direct deposit. Uh, seven days after it's delivered. So after it's delivered, they pay you the money. You can take that seventy dollars that you made on top of getting your your money back, and you can take it and do more. So that's how I was able to build a six figure business using Goodwills and thrift store. And I took that same strategy and took it online. You found it in um? No, this was on eBay. Well, so I didn't find this one in Goodwill. Well, I'm on yeah. eBay. Yes, sir. <laughs> so hey, there you have it, you guys. So uh, my uncle, who's never bought anything off of Amazon, never sold anything off of Amazon, can understand how to do this business so can you right so you can spend five days with Travis and learn this business from start to finish uh, can you tell them what they'll learn in those five days absolutely so we'll start with account creation all the way up into automating the business so that you can have more of your most valuable asset which is your time so that you won't even have to find the products you will put systems and people or virtual assistants into place to do this process for you while you enjoying you know your life 
life and creating those memories with your family. All right, and what's the youngest and oldest ages you've already trained in your program? Yeah, so the youngest was actually a teenager, 15 years old, all the way up until a, all the way up to a 75 or 77 year old gentleman. And uh, you guys, if you want to see that testimonial, uh, it's actually on my Instagram of the oldest person. Cause I was like, this is amazing. He, all five stars and definitely recommended it. So I, I kind of got the process down where I'm not leaving out any steps. You know, hey, if it's something, again, that you believe you just need the right answer and you're willing to um, apply the steps, then it, I'm a thousand percent certain that it'll work for you. All right. Link to that upcoming trade is down in the description below. Uh, I'm going to keep that link updated. So that will always be, no matter when you see in this video, the best way to join the program and learn more. This business can change your life for the better for the rest of your life. Sure. Till next time, so much. Let's stay hustling. JT Automations. I'm gone.